Hey folks, welcome back to another edition of Backport Cigar Reviews. We're doing the Patello Bianco. The 6 by 6 and a half by 52 stick Toro box press. Here with the uh, Big Dan. Dan, what information you got on this, this cigar? Today's smoke is a Fratello Bianco, the wrapper's Mexican San Andreas, the binders from the Dominican Republic. And the filler is a mixture of Nicaraguan, Pennsylvania, and Peruvian. The size they call it a boxer, it's a six and a quarter by 52 Toro. It's medium, and it's about $10 a stick. Love the notch cutter. Should be all right. Yeah. Take the band off. Uh, cold draw. Nice firm draw. Uh, hint of sweetness. Definitely sweetness. Almost smells like a get a little bit of raisin for the smell, but almost perfumey. Floral. Yeah, it's like a almost like a a pungence of a rose. Yeah. All right, load her up. Right off the bat, I get a blast of red pepper, both when I inhale and on the retrohale. A little early to pick up any other kind of flavor, but definitely a Peppery. Yeah, a little pepper on the retro house, not too strong, getting a little bit of an oak, burnt oak taste, and uh, getting a mild espresso. Getting a little bit of sweetness of, of a raisin. Not too sweet, but uh, the draw is great. Uh, one point I want to bring up, uh, I'm having trouble with the cigar company because I've, I've had actually this before, and I had the red label one, and I know they had the, uh, the Connecticut. So I don't know if this is the, called the Bianco, right? Or the red label is the Bianco, or this Bianco one Bianco. Yeah, it's two. a little labeling's this, a little confusing. Yeah, yeah, this is the Bianco white label, which in Italian means brother. All right, back to the first third, the Fratello Bianco white label. Still getting a little bit of sweetness, a little bit of. Slight bit of oak. Uh, great burn cigar so far. The ash is good. The draw is perfect. More of a medium cigar. Maybe go more towards the mild side. I don't know. But so far, I'm getting a little bit of sweetness of the raisin and a little bit of oak and maybe a little bit of chocolate. I think is uh, coming in. A yeah, little I'm, bit. I'm definitely picking up more wood as I smoke it. It's got plenty of smoke. The burn is just a little irregular. And the, um, th there is some kind of hint of underlying sweetness. I still would say it's almost like a rosy kind of a pungency to it, but it's very, very mild. Back to second, third here, almost down to the wrapper. Uh, burn still great. Pick it up a little bit more chocolate in this sweetness. Uh, not as much oak as I had before. The pepper is completely gone. Uh, Get a little fly here, but uh, getting ready to take this wrapper off. But so far, it's a very enjoyable smoke. What do you got there, yes. Dan, on it? Yeah, the the woodiness is pretty much gone. I'm, I'm picking up a little bit of fruitiness. It's hard to place it, but there's a, there's an underlying sweetness that's very very mild, and the smoke is still good. <laughs> and we're trying to finish this before the uh, it starts raining. It starts so that will. We'll finish the second part of the video inside. All right, we're almost the final third. We're gonna wrap this up because the weather isn't cooperating. I'm still getting the same taste. I towards the final third, I think the chocolate picked up a lot more. Still get that little bit of sweetness of raisin. All in all, this has been a great, great smoke. Uh, I'm gonna rate it a 4.2. Highly re recommended, enjoying it a lot. We're gonna finish the cigar up inside, but great smoke. 
I've been picking up a little more of that fruitiness you described, the raisins. The wood's died off. I rated a four. This is a very enjoyable smoke, and it stayed uh, medium through the whole thing. Yeah, the uh, the burn's perfect. Beautiful the draws burn. are perfect the draws whole time. Tons of smoke coming out of here. Great taste to it. Definitely buy a box of these bad boys. And uh, I think we should do a review on the red label also. Yep. Yes. Well, that's going to do it for Back Porch Cigar Reviews. We'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.